Today, guys, is going to be so much fun. I am so excited. I hope you guys are too. Today, we're going to be checking out the Mark 5 25 from Mesa Boogie. Let's get into it. So what is going on everybody? Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Now guys, you know you know me, I get to be excited about all the gear and all the stuff that I have on this channel, but today guys, I'm sincerely, sincerely excited about this video because I have my favorite amplifier of all time back in my possession and back on this channel. So I said it before in the unboxing guys, yes, the Mark V 25 is, was, and always will most likely be my dream amplifier for a couple reasons. First reason, I love Mesa Boogie, man. Reason number two is it looks cool, man. It looks cool, it looks sleek, it looks classy, but yeah, it's got a little modern twist to it with all the additional features, which is a nice segue into the third reason why I love it is the features itself. This amp is a two channel amp, but really guys, it's like, a, like eight amplifiers built into one. It really is. So first channel, channel one, you have a clean, you have a fat, and then you have a crunch. So basically what this means in layman's terms, guys, is you have a regular old clean channel, the boogie clean, which is, you know, imperative for a Mesa boogie amp to have an awesome clean sound. Then you have the fat, which can then be turned into a bit of a crunch style slash, you know, classic rock. But then you also have the crunch mode, which is basically channel two of the big boy, the big make Mesa boogie mark five. And that is where you get like your nice John Petrucci rhythm sound. More on that in a second. Now for this channel, you have the Mark 2C Plus, the Mark 4, and the Extreme, which really in layman's terms is the Mark 5 gain stage. So you have three gain stages on channel two. So between two channels, you have three gain stages basically for each. So a total of six different gain stages. Then you have two independent reverbs. You have the ability to run 25 watts to 10 watts. You have an EQ. You have all this different stuff built in and I really sincerely love it. For this song, quad track guitars using my Legator Ghost X series guitar. I love that guitar, I'll be honest with you. Using an Ibanez Tube Screamer in front, as well as a Sentry noise gate in front of the amplifier. Four tracks, two are the channel one crunch setting and two are the Mark IV setting. Those are my two favorite settings. And that is pretty much it, guys. Running right into the universal aux box and uh, you're good to go, all right, boys? So enough of my rambling about my favorite amplifier. Let's get to the song.
So guys, that is the Mesa Boogie Mark V. Man, my overall summary, you guys, you already know where I'm going with this one. This is my favorite amplifier I've ever had in my possession. I sincerely, sincerely mean that. I guess the only negative, man, is the overall power with this amplifier. Yes, 25 watts looks bad on paper, but in reality, man, do we really need 90 watts? I mean, seriously. Do we really need to blow the doors down of my studio? Do we really need to blow the doors down in your bedroom, in your house? If you're not touring arenas, or if you're not touring, you know, any rather large venue, I really don't think you need 90 watts. So the 25 watt version, as well as the 35 watt version, are suffice. There's just something about that gain, that saturation with the Mesa Boogie Man, just like that crunchy, creamy, thick, tight sound man i really really love it man my favorite thing about this amplifier i said it in the beginning of this video but guys i love i love i love i love the channel one crunch option having a nice tight rhythm sound like i said like the pull me on there kind of dream theater john petrucci sound available in the 25 head it's just it's incredible man it's amazing it's nice to have that channel two option in this little small jam-packed amplifier it's clean it's tight it's aggressive it does have some low end but it doesn't have too much low end it doesn't have like any of that mesa boogie dual rectifier flub that it's kind of known for like mesa boogie's kind of known for it then it's extremely tight crunchy thick and awesome and i really like the channel one crunch mode aka channel two on the big boy mark V. guys overall man not only does this amplifier look cool but it sounds amazing i would love to hear from you guys in the comments below your thoughts i've said enough of my my rambling about my favorite amplifier i would love to hear from you guys leave it all down below in the comments guys if you're watching this in real time i have something huge 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 i cannot wait that is this coming friday the 26th if you're watching this guys I'm going to be doing a collab with a huge YouTuber and I cannot wait to show you guys. So be on the lookout for that. All my social media links are down below in the description of this video as well. If you're brand new to my channel and you want to consider hitting that subscribe button, I'd really, really sincerely appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. I'm out of here, boys. Stay metal. I'll see you guys next time.